this is going to be another video using the smart wash now when I do my videos for cleaning carpet everybody tells me I'm going too fast or I'm going too slow or I'm doing this or I'm doing that don't leave any comments telling me what to do this is my channel this is my carpet it's my machine I'm just going to show you what it does this carpet is fairly clean it's been cleaned before the other room which I'm going to do the other video on is an absolute nightmare but you can see over here with the best lighting I can get you uh, this carpet's not that bad there are some poofus stains over there where the dog left the big poofus and those are the results after I've cleaned it up so I I'm looking forward to seeing if that takes it out I don't think it will let me show you the other part of the carpet problem so this carpet looks like it's black this is filthy this is absolutely filthy this is the dog stuff so we're gonna be doing this in the next video see the difference I do recommend wearing hearing protection my hearing protection of course is outside right now I'm gonna to try to find some other headphones um, I'm just gonna use some hot water I might use vinegar I might you I'm not sure yet I don't know if I'm gonna use vinegar or if I'm gonna use uh, I can't remember what's the name of that stuff Folex the pros always talk about how terrible Folex is and how you need to use a professional chemical cleaner uh, but I don't really know. I don't know what I'm going to do. It's late. I can't really clean the carpet at this hour without pissing off a lot of people. So I'm going to go clean off the carpet. Thumbs up, subscribe, like, share. Uh, affiliate links, donation links in the video description, all that cool stuff. Nobody watches. Hopefully you're going to watch this. I'm going to fill this up with some warm water. Pre-treat? I don't know. I'm not sure. My sprayer is not working, so I'd love to spray some vinegar on here or some Folex. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that. Uh, dogs in the house. So I don't want to upset her with all the noise and all the chemical stuff, but here we go. I really had no idea how loud this thing is. It is loud. Check out my sexy legs. There you go. Okay, I've moved as much stuff as I really want to move. I just want to get part of this room done and uh, just because it needs it. So you're going to hear a lot of noise. I'll probably mute the video a little bit. Uh, I don't think you're going to notice most of these stains disappear in this room. Again, this room carpet's fairly clean, considering it hasn't been done by a professional. Uh, what we're going to notice is how dirty is the water. So here we go. The nice thing about this unit, maybe it's good, maybe it's bad. You don't have to press the button to make the cleaner solution go out. You don't have to press the button or take off to let it clean up. It's just automatic. When you go forward, it puts on the solution. When you go back, sucks it up and then there's a button on here for dry only which I believe sucks everything up and there's a light on this unit that tells you when it's washing and when it's drying so here we go um, it's a lot of noise I'm definitely gonna have to mute it
I decided to do a tiny little section in the living room. Now, where's the stain? That's where the dog, I think, I don't know if she pooed or peed over there, but that is a stain that's not coming out. I'm not sure if that stain is because of hers or because of the chemicals I used, but uh, what's the key? The key is that this was just a tiny little section and we did the other room. I didn't have the headphones on, so I couldn't block out the noise. I did it as quick as I could. I didn't spend a lot of time. This is about a 10 minute clean, and we're gonna go look at what came out of the carpet right now. This is a great carpet cleaner. I'm gonna show you what came out of the carpet. And that was just a small area that I cleaned, a very small area. Um, how do you open this thing? I don't want the water to spill all over the place, so I'm gonna be really careful here. Uh, I will leave an affiliate link in the video description if you want to order this thing. It is worth every penny. It's just a really good cleaner. And you're going to see, yeah, I know the carpet was filthy, but look at what this machine did. Just a short amount of time. Look at this. And I've cleaned other people's carpets, and every time I clean a carpet, it is black to brown. Excellent product, doesn't take a long time to do. If you clean it up, you don't want to spend the time, go back and clean it again and again and again. Uh, I just don't want people coming to my house. I don't want to move stuff around. I got stuff all over the place. Uh, they would only be able to clean a small area at a time. So, wonderful carpet cleaner. The Hoover, there you go. Look at that. It's a Mitzvo. Yikes. Thanks for watching, people. I will admit, this is some very tricky carpet. Even when this carpet is clean, I don't remember when this carpet was ever clean. But when this carpet is clean and I look at it, I think, is this carpet clean? It just has a weird look to it. And I do not know. I'd have to look to find a, cl uh, a spotless area that's never had dirt. But you saw the amount of dirt that came out of that bedroom and this little area that I did. And you would not, or I can't even tell that this was cleaned. I have no, I wouldn't know. It looks, the carpet is just a tricky carpet. But the carpet machine is absolutely wonderful. What I'm going to have to do on this room is I am going to have to pre-treat this really well. I'm going to have to soak this thing with pre-treatment. And I'm probably going to pull out containers worth of filth. But I cannot do that when the dog is here because that machine is very loud. And this is going to take a lot of time and a lot of chemical. But even with that, the carpet cleaner, as you saw, the filth that was in that water container. This carpet, this, the carpet machine is absolutely wonderful. If anybody has suggestions on how to remove this, I don't think you can. I don't know if that was, uh, I think that was poop. And so the stain is gone. But what ends up happening when I remove the stain, I end up getting these nice white areas. And that might be the carpet being clean because I worked on this area. So maybe this is how the carpet is supposed to look. I don't know. All I know is the fibers, they feel clean, but I wish we could buy a steam machine, and I mean a real steam machine like the commercial extractors that they use that pumps out steam and sucks it up really well. I wish we could buy that at a price of about two, three, four hundred dollars uh, If anybody's got experience using the green machine renting, let me know. I'm thinking of doing that. Um, I've used the red machine before, and I wasn't happy with it. It was an absolute mess. So if you've got experience using the big Bissell, either renting or purchasing, let me know what you think. In a situation like this, I have so much junk on the floor, I could never use that machine uh, unless I was using a hose. So hopefully you like my video. I know it was long, but hey, ladies, if it's long, it's probably a good video. Yeah?